The producers make things happen mm -hmm. in television of all kinds. We're very lucky to have reality TV producer extraordinaire Mike Bickerton on the BT Couch. Hello. Good morning, Jody. You're giving us tips I am. on how to become the stars that we want to be on reality TV. A difficult program, but there are some tips that are very salient, yes? Yeah, I think it's pretty easy. I mean, most shows cast everything online, and so you, people get to record their own audition video and upload it themselves. So really, it's all up to you about what you want to present. We, we, Sorry. You know, we were talking in the green room about this idea because you probably, you've worked on Bachelor uh, Canada and you've worked on Amazing Race. Thousands of tape probably come your way. What's the first uh, tip that you give to people for approaching the idea of putting together an audition tape? I think you really have to grab people's attention right away. I mean, I think if you're looking at thousands of tapes, which we do, um, you have about 15 seconds to really grab somebody's attention. And I think you just have to present yourself the way that you would in a job interview, you know? Talk in a full voice and try and be interesting. I mean, guess be interesting is the most. So you don't want like slides of shots of background music and graphics, you want to see the people. Totally. Those are like sort of having like a limp handshake. It's like having to wait and wait for something interesting when you really just want to hear somebody say, hi, I'm Mike and I'm this and here's who my partner is and that kind of thing. You know, you also have to imagine whether somebody is going to be able to like deliver the narration for these shows. Like, you don't want to hear somebody say, for this roadblock, you have to do this. <laughs> you want somebody who can speak in a full voice, right? And that's what grabs your attention. And when you talk about job interview, you, I mean, the idea of being yourself comes into play. Take us through the idea of, say, Amazing Race Canada, Mickey and Pete, two fan favorites. What did they do in their audition tape to truly be themselves and stand out for, for someone like you? Mickey and Pete's audition video was so bizarre, right? I mean, it was them laying on their couch in Snuggies. It was them in three-piece leisure suits, awesome. posing. And they were just themselves, right? And, you know, one of my producers watched the tape and said, I don't know if you're going to like these guys, but I love them. Well, I watched the tape and I said, oh, I don't know if my bosses are going to like them, but I love them. And we just kept saying that, the production company, at the network, until they were on the start line, you know? And the, the thing that they did was they were just themselves and they were just, they didn't have any pretense and they got an interview. And when we were at the interview, we thought these guys are legitimately these nice, humble, small town guys who really don't care and uh, are just going to be themselves. What about the people who think, oh, I need to have an HD camera, it needs to be a special, I need somebody to shoot it for me? It can just be. It can be your iPhone. I mean, some people go through elaborate skits and they do these big adventure travel things and that's what the shows will give you. They'll give you the chance to go on fantasy dates or like go on an adventure with a teammate. So we don't need you to shoot that. We just need you to like sit down with your partner and say, hi, I'm Riaz, I'm Jody. Like, this is why we want to do the race. Now, timing has got to be key. One, let's talk about how long should an application video be and when is the best time to submit. Say hypothetically our deadline is Friday. Should we get it in by Friday or should we have submitted two weeks ago? I mean, people that stand out are always going to stand out no matter when you see their tape, but it's the volume of noise around those people that really makes a difference. So if the deadline is Friday, get it in on Monday, get it in weeks before the deadline, because on that Friday, there's gonna be thousands of tapes coming in. So it's a misnomer to think, I wanna be the last one in, so yeah. they see me last. It's the worst. We run into so many people that like have the technical problems at like 11.59 on the night of the deadline, and they're just kinda of out of luck. So, you know, you wanna get it in early, and you wanna just make sure that like, I saw that there was a casting call, I wanted to be on the show, check, I've done it, and you wait, wait in here. And you guys are casting right now for Amazing Race. If you're watching and you want to be a part of it, AmazingRaceCanadaCasting.com is the That's website. That's the one. Check that out. And, of course, Bachelor Canada. We love the drama. Tuesday nights, tonight, it's on City, new night. Make sure you check that out. And uh, he's done all the groundwork behind to make sure quality comes out on screen. Thanks Good so advice. much, Mike. Thanks, guys. Good advice from Mike Bickerton.